This is Cruise News Today with Doug Parker. Good morning. Here's your cruise news for Monday, July 3rd. Look out for gratuity hikes. Celebrity Cruises has quietly increased the rates for automatic gratuities on its cruises starting from July 11th onward. Now, this is the second increase in less than a year for the cruise line, and the new rates will vary between the type of stateroom you stay in and range from $18 to $23 per person per day. Now, this is how it breaks down. $18 per person per day for inside ocean view and veranda staterooms. It'll be $18.50 per person per day for concierge class and aqua class staterooms and a $2 increase to $23 per person per day for guests of the retreat. Now, if you already have a cruise booked with celebrity and gratuities are included, those, range, uh, those rates won't change for you. However, new bookings will be subject to a higher gratuity rate. Prepaying the gratuities before July 11th can help avoid these higher gratuity costs. And after Carnival Cruise Line guests lost their mind over the removal of cheese plates and strawberry bisque off the line's revamped menu, they can now sleep a little easier. Both artery-clogging delights we added back to the menu. Over the weekend, Carnival Cruise Line's brand ambassador, John Heald, posted photos of both dishes, saying, quote, I'll be back. Carnival revised their menus late last month, modifying 60 dishes, adding items like entree salads, and creating new dishes by Chef Emeril Lagasse. The line also said they would soon be rolling out dedicated vegetarian menus for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And sorry, your Christmas cruise has been canceled. Yeah, that's the letter that guests on Royal Caribbean's Freedom of the Seas received for their sailing on Christmas, December 2024, and going into New Year's on 2025. The ship is going to dry dock for necessary maintenance. Guests received notifications about the cancellations, including Christmas and New Year's. Now, passengers can rebook on other select sailings on Freedom or Oasis of the Seas. They can also choose another Royal Royal Caribbean sailing, or just get a refund altogether. The dry dock specifics were not provided. And cruise line stocks were up on Friday. Carnival Corporation up 9%, 18.83. Royal Caribbean up 2%, 103.73. And Norwegian up 4%, 21.77. Breaking news and industry coverage at cruiseradio.net. I'm Doug Parker with Cruise News Today. Cruise News Today is a production of Cruise Radio. Behind the scenes content and extras are now available at patreon.com slash cruiseradio.